Oh. Whoa. Whoa, what's going on? Oh my god, I'm recording. Okay, I don't know when my recording started, but I almost crashed. Uh, I am back, I am Psy Starcraft, and I am giving you some Heart of the Swarm beta. I got Protoss this time, so I need a Cybernetics Core for a Mothership Core. Um, this game's still a little bit buggy. I have crashed a few times on the loading screen. It might be because of fraps, it might just be because of uh, the nature of the beta. Or a combination of both. Anyway, we have a PVT, so Protoss versus Terran. Uh, myself being Protoss, obviously. And we will see um, what kind of cool strategies I can employ. Uh, a lot of fun last game, uh, Z the ZVP that you guys watched. Swarmhost pretty good, man. Swarmhost pretty good. So Mothership Core requires a Cybernex Core. Uh, you can't have another Mothership Core or a Mothership. So that is good to note. Uh, looks like I'm just going to be standing, starting out with just like a normal um, gateway build into core. And then I want to have my 100 gas ready right away for my Mothership Core. Because I'm pretty sure Mothership Core is kind of a, is a unit that really helps out with macro. So uh, we'll have to just find out here. And I, I cannot express how much I love this worker counter. So, so cool. It's going to be so damn helpful. I mean, it, obviously, it's kind of like, oh, caters to noobs, blah, 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 blah. But really, there are some things in this game that you shouldn't have to spend excess your excess time doing. And one of them is, like, scrolling all your workers and figuring out how many you have. Some people might argue that that's part of the skill of the game. But I argue that's just kind of a silly little... Um, required mechanic that you have to master when you shouldn't have to. It just kind of takes away from the game, especially when you're Zerg. I know I briefly touched upon this last time, but uh, I'm so passionate about it. So anyway, my opponent likes to Womp Womp. Again, he's Terran. And looks like I'm, I'm going to change myself to green. Oh yeah, I love green. You guys know how I love trolling you with the color changes and all that. And uh, looks like this is a four-player map. I haven't scouted because I'm terrible at this game, but that's okay because this is Heart of the Swarm. And you don't have to scout in Heart of the Swarm. Fact. It's that easy. So what is their new for Protoss? There are the two Stargate units. Um, is that it? Like, that's not even fun. I don't want to go Stargate units. It seems kind of boring. Huh. Die, scum. Oh, man, that didn't work. Don't kill my cybernetics, score, you bastard. So how do I actually start it? I started on my... Okay, let's do that. Oh, I should have saved up Chrono for my Mothership Core. I'm so curious to see what this thing looks like. I guess I'll get a Stalker as well. Uh, and a Pylon. Just to put it right next to the other Pylon, I suppose. Mothership Core is almost finished. Can use Mass Recall, Purify, and Energize. So that's pretty much like the custom. I guess I'll hotkey that to two. Oh, and you can upgrade it to a Mothership once you have a Fleet Beacon. Alright. I wonder what the mothership has. It still has cloak. That's weird because the oracles, I think, have a cloak ability now. I don't know. Anyway, let's uh, let's get a. Speaking of oracles, let's get a thing. Let's get another pile. I'll just keep up with the energize. Maximum maximize energy on a structure or units. Purify. Powers up the mothership core, allowing it to gain a powerful weapon. Wait, can I just like send this to the enemy and purify him with it? Oh my gosh, I am totally gonna do that. Go mothership core and mass recall. Okay, that's pretty self-explanatory. I guess I'll start warp gates. Kind of forgot about that. And let's get a couple more gateways, just so we've got uh, some solidness. Go mothership core. Go kill stuff. Go kill stuff. You crazy bastard, bitch, lady. Let's go to sentry. Okay, so he's in the top right. Let's start bringing the mothership core that way. What if? Wait. What is? What else can you do? Uh, that's it. Okay. Does she, like, get slower if she's not in range of a pylon or something? Or is she always that slow? Because that's pretty freaking slow, man. Oracle. 200 gas for an Oracle. Holy shiitake ball sacks. That is a lot of gas. This guy seems like he's not that bad, so I'm kind of worried that this whole strategy isn't going to work. But, uh, we'll see. We'll see. You never know, man. You gotta start that Oracle. Is he coming yet? Nope, he's not coming. Very well. I need to like, uh oh, uh oh, no, no, oh, okay. I thought I was going to crash. Just crash on me, guy. So I already have 24 workers, that's a lot. Um, still nothing out of there. Ah, oh, pylons, fuck pylons. Damn, I'm so bad at this game. Go get a mothership core. Actually, she'll die so fast if she runs into marines. Maybe I should just energize my uh, nexus. It's a range of that. 
E or N for a hotkey. That's a terrible hotkey. What were you thinking, Blizzard? You don't put N as a hotkey for anything. That's so fucking terrible. A bunch of boobs. Preordain and Tomb and Revelation. Preordain. Grant vision. Display what's constructing. Reveals units within the area. Units revealed cannot. So he's got like a scouting ability. I'm gonna energize my Oracle. Go ahead and send it out. Um, cancel you. Not really doing much with my money here, am I? This is not a very good macro game. Uh, okay, let's get some more of these, I guess. And let's send him in. And uh, I guess I'll just keep you there because you're dumb. Alright. And I'll just keep making a use. So he does have an expansion here. It is destined. So what is this revelation? So it's just like a scan, like a localized scan. So I guess I'll entomb his stuff here and stop his mining. So that's cool. I kind of want to like see what this looks like. I'm going to use it on the engineering bay. So it tells me how far along it is and what he's researching. So this guy is actually not killing the buildings that I just entombed. So maybe, okay now he is. He just didn't want to do it with the SUVs. So it gives me vision and it shows me what's going on. It's kind of cool I guess. Oh, he's got a SCV just coming shot from there. I guess I should kill that, huh? Uh, SCV. And, uh, okay, he's getting turrets. He's getting a couple turrets just for my Oracle. That's kind of weird. I don't know if that's smart or not. Probably. I don't know. And, yeah, that's, that's like the extent of the new Protoss units. I have to say I'm a bit underwhelmed. Um, I don't see any new upgrades or anything. I guess the Mothership Core is kind of cool. I don't know. Let's do a transfer. A couple simulators. Some zealots, I guess. Attack. I really need to spend my, uh, uh oh. Get away from me. Oh, this guy's still BM. He's attacking me already. Okay, how do I do this? How do I do this? Purify. Purify. Oh yeah! Oh yeah! Blast them, bitches! Blast them! Blast them! Blast them! Go! Go! Blast! 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 Attack! What are you doing? Attack them, you mother- Yeah! Yeah! It's awesome! How much energy does that cost? 75? So I can do it again? How long does that last? F it lasts 45 seconds? Holy shit! That's awesome. Where'd my oracle go? Oh, there you are. Alright, I'm gonna try to get another entomb off. I don't know if I can do it without dying, though. Oh, look at that. Turrets, turrets are not gonna be an answer. Turrets are no, never gonna be an answer for a uh, oracle. That's really annoying. It's like he has to get... Uh, what am I doing? I don't even know what I'm doing. He has to get... Like a viking or something, you know? It's really weird. Right, let's do that. He's trying to kill that with his SCVs. Dang, that's annoying. I suppose they have like stuff like the Mothership Core to uh, try to encourage macro games, which is pretty neat, I guess. I suppose. There's the scan. Um, what can I do now? Like, where do I go from here? I guess I can just kind of be aggressive and then mass recall if something bad happens. He's gonna have so much infantry though. He's gonna have so much infantry. Alright Oracle, you're gonna be doing it again here soon. Let's see what he's doing over here. We're gonna boost that. Oh boy. Oh, he doesn't have anything. He's got like none. He's got very little. I really wanna force field you out. You mad bro? He's so mad right now. Look how mad he is. Uh, let's like warp more stuff. I'll warp him on way back there because that's how good I am at this game. Alright, while this is going on, we're going to do another Entomb. Let's get a nice little R. So he's going to be distracted at the front, and it's not going to be mining at all this entire time. Force field this bunker. Uh oh. Oh no. Chrono boost. Oh, where's my core? Oh, GG. Damn it! Yeah, look at this. So distracted at the front, he's still getting Entombed. I wanted to send... Okay, this is so slow, man. You have to like be on top of things with the positioning. Purify, energize. Why can't you move faster than that, you fat slut? And I could have mass recalled if I needed to. 
I wanna, I wanna use Purify real fast. Okay, so you press Purify, you don't actually have to target anything. And you get a 7 range, 25 damage attack. Pretty fast attack speed, so that's... That's solid, man. We agree. Look how slow she is! Get him! Get him! Can you attack on the move? Okay, and it can attack on the move. Yeah, that's pretty good DPS, man. Alright, well, hope you guys enjoyed that. That was a PVT on some map. I don't know. See ya.